Welcome back to 242 Math. I'm your host Raphael Thompson. Today we'll be looking at computation for grade 6. Here we go grade 6 students. Question number 1. 1 1.26 plus 97 plus 86.9. And we move on to question two, two and a quarter plus four fifths. Moving right along to question three. $701.75, take away $96.50. And question four, 456 plus a number, take away 196 is equal to four, Hundred ninety seven. Question five two and a half take away two thirds. And we move on to question six, 245 times 213. And we move on to question seven, 346.5 divided by 15. Moving right along question eight, two and two thirds divided by six. And we move on to question nine, 10 plus three squared times six. Final question, question number 10, 25% of 80. Okay, grade six, get ready to mark. Here we go. Answers. Question one, you are to line them up and add. So it's 1.26 and 97.0086.9. So you get 185.16. Question two, two ways to do it. So you can say two and then add your fractions, or you can change it, change two and a quarter to a proper fraction and then add. Both ways you do it. I would prefer you change it to an improper and add. You get three and one twentieth. Whichever way you do it. Question three, you have to rename. So when you rename and you subtract, you get $605.25. Question number four, you have to subtract 456 minus 196, and then still subtract that answer from 497, final answer 237. Question five, subtraction with fractions. Two ways to do it. You can 
either change it to an improper fraction or you can just leave the whole number and then subtract the fractions. Any way you do it, you get 1 and 5, 6. Question number 6. Multiplying an Islam multiplication multiplied by 3, then add a 0 multiplied by 1. Add final answer, 52,185. Question number 7. 346.5 divided by 15. You divide 15 into 34. Goes twice, you get 30. You put the remainder down. 4, bring down to 6. 15 to 46, 3 times. You get a remainder of 1, bring down to 5. And then the 15 goes once. So 23.1, final answer. Question 8. You're dividing with fractions, so you change it on the improper fraction, and then you have to multiply, so you turn it upside down, you get four ninths. Question nine, you have to work out three squared first, which is nine, and then multiply that by six before you add, and you get 64. Final question, 25% of 80. When you cancel that all down, you get 20. 25% of 80 is 20. Got it? Grade 6, that's computation test 1. I will see you in the next one. That's a wrap.